Now, your I Think Financial Sports Desk from WPTV and ESPN 1063. Good evening, good people. I'm Theo Dorsey from ESPN 1063. And of course, we had to bring the sports on the road tonight because for the first time in nine years, the Kaseya Center hosted the Miami Heat's NBA Finals game. I mean, this is a huge deal. And for years, for years, Heat fans and Heat Nation have had to succumb to the phrase and the slur, uh, bandwagon fans. But you know what? Tonight, Miami Heat in true Heat culture fashion, leaning in on that phrase. Yo, we on the bandwagon! We on the bandwagon! I'll hop on that bandwagon any day of the week! Tonight, DJ Irie, former Heat sharpshooter Mike Miller, and Starry creating a literal Heat bandwagon outside of the Kaseya Center. I like it. They know that Heat fans ain't bandwagon fans, but it's, it's fun to throw a little shade back at them a little bit. The last time the Heat competed for the Larry O'Brien Trophy, it came inside the NBA bubble in Orlando. Tonight, fans have the chance to cheer on their squad, and it just feels right. Now that I've stepped onto the premises, it's all coming back now. It's all coming back. Been here a few times before. Obviously, the last time was in the bubble, but you know what? Now it feels right. It feels right. We're back, right back where we belong in the NBA Finals. This run is one that many didn't see coming, especially with the Heat being an eight seed. But getting to the mountaintop is just part of this team, and with that comes a bandwagon filling up. What they build here and what they've done here, it's almost like an expectation, when even it's not an expectation. You know, they've just done a great job of, of, of a core team, a core nucleus of guys. Uh, creating a heat culture that, uh, you know, sounds like a cliche, but it's not. I mean, it's, it's real, and, and it keeps showing that time and time again. Tonight, those lucky Heat fans were all rewarded with tickets to Game 3. Their presence is just as much a part of the team as the guys on the court all season long. They're unbelievable. I mean, there's a lot of reasons we were as successful as we were, and this team continues to be successful. I mean, they're, they're great basketball fans. Obviously, they show out tonight. It's going to be a lot of great atmosphere in there tonight. Uh, far from bandwagon fans. Well, don't completely pump the brakes on the bandwagon because the series isn't over just yet, but the Miami Heat couldn't get it done here at the Sea Center as they fall to the Nuggets going down 2-1 in the NBA Finals. Game four going to be Friday night right back here at the Kaseya Center. You expect to hear that same energy from fans and maybe a new gimmick outside of just the bandwagon as you try to get everything rowdy back up to see if he can air, even things up at two apiece. Until then, at Kaseya Center, Theo Dorsey for ESPN 106.3 on WPTV.